You're listening to the Sands Fans Network. Hey everybody and welcome to this week's episode of Baseless Speculation on the Pop Culture News and the Research so you don't have to. I'm Joel. I'm Jackson. And I'm back. <laughs> now, I, I was sick and yeah. now I'm Joel. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> now boys and back, uh, <laughs> what, do you, what do you think is going to happen in the UK? Speculation's been like, we've speculated on yeah. movies, we've speculated on, on television on TV shows. shows. Yeah. Video games, once or twice. Once, once or twice. twice. And now it's time for us to step into the real dimension yeah. and speculate what's going to happen on the weekly planet X plumbing the Death Star mm-hmm. without Joel Zammett yep. and without Nick Mason 2024 UK tour. That's right. We're not just speculating on what's going to happen in the United Kingdom in general. Nothing good. Nothing good. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even want to dip yeah. my toe, but I can yeah. talk about yeah. what I might do. Over yeah, there. that's true. And yeah. I might talk about what I might do when uh, I'm not in the UK. Yeah, very fair. Yeah, very yeah fair. rest, I reckon. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah Roll yeah. rest. I'd like slash... to try to rest. Mm. One of those. It'll be one of those things where I'm like, I'm going to try and sleep a lot. I'm going to try and maybe like sleep in, mm. and I'll like. I look at my clock and it's 5 a.m. and I got a headache and I got to get out of bed so I got to take some meds and I'm yeah. like then I'm like awake and I'm like and then you look life. at your wife who's eight months pregnant <laughs> and you're like hmm um, really should be resting right yeah, now really this is my chance rest. really should yeah rest. that's okay I mean like you've got mm. one month to rest before you probably can't rest again for at least eight years yeah. 18 I think eight, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and then surely we'll keep there's a there's a sweet yeah. spot for kids where they just fucking calm down a bit yeah well it's, I reckon it's different, no rest. When mm. it's a teenager, you're like, mm. what are they doing out there? Yeah. What are they doing what out there? What are they there? getting off to? Drugs. Why are they rebelling against me? Yeah. Yeah. Why do they hate their dad? Why? Well, I'm the cool dad. <laughs> I'm the weekend dad. Do you think you'll be the cool dad? I mean, they've only got one dad, so <laughs> by default, You'll be your, I'll both true. be the cool and lame one. Well, it's going to be interesting to see what they do to rebel because yeah. media, like, they're not going to want to play video games or yeah. watch TV. Well, That's your job. I know. It's going to be weird. Like, what's going to happen in, yeah, like, what, skateboarding? Like 16 years? Is skateboarding yeah. going to be a sports? thing in 15? <laughs> Who knows? The sports Sport. could be, yeah. yeah. But then, then they're going to be like, oh, yeah, I'm, I went to skateboarding. I'm like, hell yeah, I used to rollerblade. Let's see what you're going to go. I'll go get the... <laughs> yes. Two supporters. You're so ready to be a dad. <laughs> uh, same thing with like sport. Uh, once again, I used I played I used to play football, soccer, mm. and all those kinds. Of, love all mm. those kind of things. Every time I, I I forget how much I love AFL until I'm sitting there yeah, or standing there. Again, I'm gotten the dad pose like perfect. Yeah. yeah. Come in, game is halfway on, stand. and I just stand, arms crossed, and I'm there for about an hour. <laughs> yes. Yeah. That's right. a great dad stand. What about this one? I like this one. I like the hands, hands on the kind like, of reversed on your hips. You like you hold kind of, protecting yeah. your kid. <laughs> yeah, yeah exactly. I've been doing that a lot more recently, I unbeknownst to why. I hate uh, it. I hate that that's my neutral stance. Yeah. Yeah, I think this is one of those innate things, just clicks in. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, time you... to stand like this now. <laughs> hey, well, your neutral stance is a lot better than mine. My neutral stance currently is cock shame, <laughs> which <laughs> no. I really don't like. That's bad. No, dude. I hold my <laughs> hand like that, but it's still <laughs> cock shamey. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. I would, I prefer to, I'm like, I shouldn't cross my arms, yeah. it's rude. But then I'm cock shaming it up. Yeah, dude. Don't want to be doing that. What's the alternative? I I prefer the Lawrence Fishburne like hand holding behind his back oh, yeah. in the Matrix. Oh, that's yeah. good. You know that, that one. It's yeah. a crazy one to do sitting down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's weird doing it sitting down, but you can do it. Do you? Do you? Should you ever think with Johnny Baby on the way? Mm. Do you ever think that we'll be part of a child's childhood? Uh, yeah, I think about that all the time. That's that when so- they're like forty mm. and they reminisce about their childhood, we mm. strangers. <laughs> Not family. <laughs> right, I don't think family. we'll. I don't think we'll be counted as strangers either. <laughs> no. <laughs> Stra- just guys. Just it's guys. our names. <laughs> Even what we look like. I don't know. That's yeah, crazy. Well, we, at that point, the baby's 40, so we've been dead for 39 years. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's yeah, true. Yeah, 100%. What's going to happen? <laughs> nothing good. Nothing good, good okay, dude. Nothing enough. good. Um, what do you think you're going to do in the mm. UK, do show? All right. What do you think is going to happen? Well, I guess like it's probably worth pointing out. Uh, mm. To speculate on this properly, we'll start in the same way we'd start at a movie. We'll okay. just lay out the basics. Yeah, great idea. Yeah, yeah, great yeah, idea. Yeah, so yeah. we land in London. Mm-hmm. 
That's on, true. I believe, a Tuesday or Wednesday. Hey, hey, hey. Now I can be the man in the chair looking up some research oh, because I have yeah. a Google spreadsheet for this. <laughs> Whoa, that's so, awesome. I believe that we land in the UK, in London, on a Wednesday. Wednesday. I think it's mm-hmm. a Wednesday. And then our first show is Friday. Yeah. So we've got two days to figure out what the now, fuck's going on and one, to figure out a clock. They, yeah, day one's going to be Johnny Jetlagged. Yeah. Where we just sleep in a bed somewhere. <laughs> yeah, probably at our accommodation, I imagine. <laughs> yeah, that makes One sense. would hope. Yeah. yeah. So okay. So yes, you arrive. I believe yes on a Wednesday. Yeah. What time? Um. Uh, that one is another great question because I don't know if you're arriving because I got on the calendar that yeah. I think you arrive uh, at five twenty-five a.m. But then also it's maybe at no. I think you arrive in. <laughs> you arrive... I truly hope that's wrong. <laughs> no, because I think you arrive five uh, twenty-five. Oh, maybe at one point. I believe that's in in Singapore, depending on what the layover. Is. Yeah, that's good. And then maybe you arrive in London at 8.05 a.m., but I don't that's... know if that's 8.05 a.m. Australian time or <laughs> if that's 8.05 London time. I can't wait for I haven't seen our plane tickets. So I have I... them, but I don't want to look at them. I want to speculate. <laughs> yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I really hope that it's 5 a.m. in Singapore because there's a real vibe to, like, a long layover Especially we're up with us. A long layover. How long are we laying over for? <laughs> I don't know. But I hope I it's short. I think it's like a, I think it's maybe a few hours. That's I fine. That's, Enough yeah, no, to no. get to. The, uh, okay, yeah. so if it's Singapore Airport, we've done this a couple yeah. of times. Basically, you get off the flight, you wander into that food court area, you yeah. look at the Seven Eleven, and you go, "Oh, this is a mm. fucked up Seven yeah. Eleven for me in Australia." Okay. My stomach already feels okay. fucking awful. But There's I a guess Burger I'll, King, yeah. and again, they, they'll do like a cold Milo drink, and yeah. we're like, "That's wild." That, we we got Milo, but we don't have it at Burger King. We also don't have Burger King. We got Hungry Jacks. Yeah, that's true, dude. Because one guy in Adelaide was like, hey, Burger I'm King, the Burger I'm King. the Burger King. And then Burger King from America was like, well, yeah, we'll see what the courts say about that. And the courts were like, he's, <laughs> he, the, he's Burger the Burger King. King. Dude, I don't know what to tell you. You guys You're are Hungry Jacks now. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Um, um, what I love about the, those layovers, especially when mm-hmm. it's really early in the morning, is that when it's me and you, Dusha, yeah. flying together, and yep. just, we've, do, we've often done this a couple of yeah, times. Yeah, done this a couple of times. The early part, arriving at Melbourne Airport, we're laughing. Yeah. We're goofing mm. around. The riff machine's in action. Even on the plane. Get stupid, yeah. Get silly. Singapore, 5 a.m.? We're sitting across from each other at a table like this. Be like, we shouldn't have eaten, but I we just like did. T- I feel so bad. And then, because what sets in there yeah. is, when you fly from Australia to the UK, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. or even to America, the first flight is short. Yeah. Way, way yeah. shorter. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So... You get off the plane once, and you haven't actually really accomplished anything. And that really settles in a delay. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And it's kind of all you say to each other. You're like, it's Uh, like another 13 hours. Longer. uh, It's like another 15 hours. Uh, (laughs) It's another 15 hours on a plane, dude. It's It's like, yeah, so we just got on an eight-hour flight, watched two movies, shit Mm -hmm. my pants. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Dude, that's bad. What happened? (laughs) I was watching a really good movie. (laughs) This is awesome. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I well, think I'm going to watch this one. Don't, dude. You know what might happen. What's something worse? No, no, no. It's not that good. Fuck, man. Fuck, it was so good. He's Inception. Inception so good. <laughs> dude, uh, when that totem spun, I couldn't help yeah. myself. At the very end. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got it all the way through. <laughs> Wait, and then it all clicked for me and I realized what was going on. Oh. 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 All right. I'm <laughs> so sorry, boys. It's actually not to Singapore. So your first leg yeah. is 14 hours. <laughs> And you're gonna go. Um, you're gonna arrive in uh, Abu Dhabi. Okay, that's okay. Uh, uh, I believe. Uh, so you leave here at about three three o'clock. Okay. At PM. PM. Yep. PM yep. So that's not too bad. That's all right. And then uh, yeah. So you you arrive um, at like eleven thirty at night. Yeah, that's okay. Dhabi. That's all right. That's, that's not bad. Right. How long is the right. layover? Yeah. Uh, and then. <laughs> At 2 a.m. No! <laughs> oh, no, that's okay. That's only yeah. two and a half hours. Oh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, so that's 2 a.m. You know, uh, I'm presuming at yeah. the Derby time. Yeah. So, again, yeah, yeah, you know, okay. you've only got a couple hours, and then maybe maybe an hour delay in the fly, hopefully, mm. in, in the air, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully not more than that. <laughs> <laughs> Can't be done. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> no. uh, and then, then it's only an, an eight, oh, seven hours and 40 minutes. That's great. Okay, that's the reverse of what you The last yeah. leg is seven hours 40, and then you arrive at uh, sunny 6.45 a.m. <laughs> Okay, Baby, so it, it, stay awake the whole day. <laughs> it went, it went from oh, that's good because yeah. Uh, <laughs> hang on, how famously with hotel check-ins, you could check in at any time you want. Whoa! Not hey. true. 2 p.m. Oh, I wasn't yeah. looking at that. Yeah. <laughs> so we got to kill this. time with our bags mm-hmm. for six mm-hmm. hours. But I kind of love that vibe yeah. of when you arrive well, and you're like, 
I have to stay up the whole time because otherwise mm-hmm. my sleeping pattern's going to be fucked yes. when I get here. Well, the problem here though is um, the the hotel is not like right where you know the, no, okay. the airport is. Like mm. Heathrow, and then you got to go into London. Yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, and then you got to kind of go near. I, I believe it's like near King's Place, okay. uh, yeah. which is the which venue is where the show's going to be. Uh, yeah. So if you want to come hang out, just stake out some hotels. <laughs> Treat us like the Beatles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Except yeah. we'll be upset. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the yeah. tired Beatles. That's going to be us. Um, but I, yeah, I kind of like the vibe where you're like, mm. I have to stay up all day, and you feel mm-hmm. sort of delirious and deranged. Mm. Here's my prediction. Yeah, we'll be okay, and then it'll get to about. 5 mm-hmm. or 6 p.m. Yeah. And we'll be like, we should get something for dinner. Mm-hmm. And in getting to dinner, yeah. we will become the most tired people in the world. <laughs> yeah. And we'll just be sitting. Because this happens all the time. Yeah. We're sitting <laughs> in a restaurant for dinner and we're just like, Buh. I... It's food, I guess, yeah. but like, I don't know what I'm doing or what the fuck's going on. <laughs> um, I remember the last time we went to the UK when we were having this exact feeling, we went to an Indian restaurant. And tried to eat the hottest food imaginable. <laughs> we like, Spice will wake us up. And then we ate it and I was like, I just feel terrible. <laughs> Not only am I so exhausted, I also feel poisoned. <laughs> Why I'm, s- I'm sweating up in pain. Yeah. Why did I think this was clever? Yeah. Oh, my on fire. I'm so, so, yeah, so you arrive, yes, on uh, yes, uh, basically 7 a.m. Yep. On, Get through on September 11th, okay. uh, <laughs> Wednesday. <laughs> I have my uh, first prediction. <laughs> um, okay. Uh-huh. I feel awesome. like that we got to really make sure our visas are in check if we're landing on September 11th. I feel like there'll be a lot yeah, less a leeway than you heightened. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just things are a bit like, hey, just, just, I'm like, oh, the, odds so are, the odds of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But just in case. I think, wanna, yeah, it's like chill. one of those we things where chill. you're working at an airport, maybe you let like a couple of things slip. Yeah. But then when you look at the calendar, you're like, oh, it's September 11th. Yeah. That's the moment where you're like, yeah. all right, time you know to what? sharpen up our skills. Yeah, I gotta, gotta get my head on straight for this. Chances one. of anything happening, just as likely yeah, as any exactly. other day. But, but you've been reminded. Yeah. Yeah. Do your job. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. 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 That's yeah. Right. I should that's do right. something. Okay. Um, so then that's the Wednesday. So six. you have a whole day. Yeah. Literally a whole day on Wednesday to be fine because then Thursday you have another whole yeah. day yeah. to rest yeah. and yeah. get over yeah. jet lag. Okay. Uh, I got some friends in the UK, in London. I might try and see them on the Thursday. Okay, For that real? could keep me okay. Could keep you awake? Not that, in a stupid right. way. I don't mean like no, no, going out yeah. to like seven a.m. Oh, I just I mean like see them for lunch or dinner because yeah. then I'm like, there's a thing to keep you me, have to that's do fair, it. That's keep yeah. me keep me out of bed. <laughs> that's under- understandable. I mean, I just yeah, okay. Hey, it's it's smart, right? Yeah, yeah because it does keep you out of bed. Yeah, uh, not what I would have done. What do you want? Well, would you actually, do? at some point, we probably need to figure out the show that we're doing <laughs> yeah. on Friday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And I reckon yeah. Friday morning's probably too late for that. <laughs> hey, you might you know, be but right. Friday, well, you forget, boys, that yeah. your show is in the evening. That's so true. Friday morning. We have a whole day. Friday, 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 Friday as well. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Because it's not, it's not an, like a, you know, it's not like a six p.m. show. Yeah, it's, it's nine thirty. Nine thirty. So we've got yeah. heaps of time. Pretty much that. We've actually got two days. Yeah, two days on Thursday. So, <laughs> well, yeah, when you think about it, Thursday. well, not just that, when you think about it, you land it in the morning, yeah. right, on Wednesday. That's two days right there. That's and then on true. Thursday, that's another two days. Yeah, because like, And then Friday, days, which is one day. It's one day, so but then got, we got the show at night. Yeah. Yeah, so you got five days. We got five really, days in you, three basically days. a week. <laughs> yeah. We basically so, land, a week goes by, then we do our show. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, you wow. land on the Wednesday. In theory, you've got like five days there. In practice, uh, uh, <laughs> Two. two, but yeah, um, yeah, yeah, in yeah. reality, mm. five. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. In uh, theory, two. In reality, five. Yes, the ones. Yeah. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Uh, then to perform uh, yeah. to, to the wonderful people of London. Okay. Yeah, there's it's a couple of tickets left uh, Not for many. the first Plumbing the Death Star show. So we are yeah. trialing this show in front of 400 people <laughs> yeah, yeah. minus. Yeah. Ten, yeah, yeah, yeah. Three hundred and ninety people. It should be easy. It should yeah. be easy. I think. I think you've got like a handful of tickets available. Yeah. Uh, so you yeah. can head to sandspitsradio.com forward slash events yeah. and mm-hmm. click on that if you're like, fuck, this actually this it, sounds sounds, it sounded shit until I listened to this episode, and now <laughs> no, I know how tired the boys yeah, will I'm be. I'm gonna try and get in on this. Boy. Maybe they'll fall asleep on stage. Mm. Maybe, and they yeah. might. Well, yeah. it's entirely well, possible. I just helped tour a band in a, yeah. in uh, from America and Australia. Yeah. Uh, just helped out with like the Melbourne and Sydney stuff. They had what like they landed uh, on a night, yeah. Had one day and then played a show, yeah. And they did that, and they're in a band which requires a lot more talent than a podcast. <laughs> and that 
They're like a little bit older than us. Yeah. And if they could do that, oh, yeah. that really filled me well, with confidence that maybe we can pull off a miracle. Well, here. remember, was it the first or second UK tour we ever It was did? the second, second one where we, we got, landed. Off we got detained by costumes. Yes. Uh, then, <laughs> then we were originally going to have like seven hours yeah. in the U- uh, in Edinburgh before yeah. we performed. Yeah. But we got detained by costumes, so that cut it down to about four. Yeah. Um, and then... Mm. Uh, yeah, we went on stage. I tripped over straight you nearly, away. Nearly fell yeah. over My first words on stage were Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah. It was good. It was yeah. good. That day, I get like a. Cause I think you were at the layover, or you maybe you've been stuck at customs, or something had happened. Yeah. But I had enough time to be like, I guess I need to contact whoever is in Edinburgh to see if <laughs> yeah. I can. Uh, as uh, as much as I think I could probably do the show alone. Yeah. <laughs> do I the can't. people want that? Uh, <laughs> also, I can't. I, look, I can spin my wheels the best of time uh, by myself on stage, sitting down. This is not even stand up at this <laughs> I, point. I don't know what it is. I think we a should. Man, like a man crashes and burns <laughs> yeah. very quickly. The jobs uh, have it to us. Hey, everybody. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, usually we argue. Ah, fuck. <laughs> I, I think we should make a pact right here, right now. If okay. any of us are ever too sick to do the show, we should just grab someone from the crowd. No, uh, I think so. It's like, they know. They, they get it. Know. And like, yeah, look, listeners, obviously you haven't been doing this for 12 years or whatever, so you're going to be shitter than it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, shitter than us at it. But are we that good at it? I disagree. I think They'll some, know like, our stuff better than we do. Yeah. Potentially they'll know their stuff more. They, they, they haven't been beaten down uh, over the last... 12 Ooh. years like we have. They're fresh. They're fresh. They're, fresh. They're excited. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, they've got like, you know, like a bit of pep in them, mm. maybe. To yeah. be like, oh, yeah, no, I reckon this could be fun. Yeah. Um, and they they, they, they might be excited. But and they, they might could bring be shy. Something to the table. Well, they they could we're not be shy. shy. Yeah, that's the that's a yeah. real sort of We're just loud. Devil's edge. Yeah. I think after doing a show in Manchester once where I mm. – uh, like maybe like an hour before we were meant to go on stage, took one of the worst shits of my life and it didn't make my stomach feel yeah. better. And I was like, oh no, mm-hmm. no relief. Mm-hmm. And also I need to sit on stage for an hour and a half. Mm-hmm. And then I had to say, hey, if I leave the stage, it's so that I didn't shit my yeah, pants yeah, in yeah, front yeah. of all of you. Yeah. I think from that yeah. moment onwards, yeah. confidence was never going to be an issue. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, I think uh, um, here's a little word of advice if you're ever going to be performing. Yeah. Um, so if you go to say a little uh, before you know performance dinner mm-hmm. or like a little snack or something, little snacky snack yeah and you go to a place and they're like uh maybe it's either a crepe place or a burger joint i forget which, I which it was, it was. i think it might have been crepe yeah and they're like hey do you want to try <laughs> the charcoal black crepe <laughs> that is probably looks like poison yeah uh say no yeah uh, mm. don't do what i did and say yeah all right because oh boy you uh, be... oh no you have the green light to go on stage yeah. and you'll be shitting in the bar, uh, the, 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 I guess the green, the green room. room toilet, yeah. being mm. like, do not go on stage! Say no! <laughs> and me and Dusha, we look at the light as it flashes, being like, come on stage now! And, and we're like, the, we can hear the clapping, yeah, and we're on. like, oh. Simon is currently diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> what do we do? Do go on stage and say, he'll be out in a second? He's like, no! I'm like, oh, okay, oh, yeah, I'm I'm no! I'm there, fucking, like, fucking legs up, braced against the door, my shirt's off because I'm sweating, and I'm like, don't you dare go on stage! You know what's so scary is that both of you have had um, stage diarrhea. Yeah. yeah, I never have. Yeah. And I feel like maybe this is my year. Mm. <laughs> yeah, King's Place. King's 400 place. people, but also they're going to fuck up somehow and you'll be wearing a lapel microphone. <laughs> so it is the broadcasting you shitting to the ground. My microphone for some reason is hooked on the back of my pants. <laughs> <laughs> then you see like a far away, oh, oh, and then the loudest, wettest farts of all time. Mm-hmm. And I'll be like, oh yeah, this sounds like plumbing the death stuff. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I remember this show. Yeah, 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 yeah. I used to listen to this podcast. Well, yeah. do we want it? We've cracked out the old, uh, the classic um uh, BS bingo card for uh-huh. the UK. It's yeah. got it down here. Do we want to put somewhere on it, Jackson has diarrhea on stage? <laughs> yeah, yes. I think top left corner. Yeah, yep. top uh, left yep. corner. Jackson Jackson has written has down. Jack has done it. He already did. I'm well ahead of you, boys. Jack shits himself. <laughs> okay, beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. I liked beautiful it for beautiful. both of you when you had diarrhea on stage. It was like, don't go on, don't go on. But for me, it will be on the stage. <laughs> yeah. I feel for you, it'll kick in uh, like uh, 20 minutes in. Yeah. Yeah. As, uh, luckily think, for us, it was just before. I think it is yeah. really fun to imagine obviously me shitting myself on stage hilarious Yo, but it's yeah. also very funny to imagine me in the middle of a roof just getting up and run <laughs> <laughs> I just don't know what like you, you do in that situation because if you can be like for example I've if spoken it's a, to people that have shit themselves on stage before yeah and they were just like you just they'll, you're like you alright the distance between me and the crowd means that they can't tell yeah mm-hmm. And the smell won't reach them. Hopefully. Yeah. 
Fingers crossed. Fingers I remember crossed. watching an interview with a, a, he was a rapper on a podcast and he was talking about how he had terrible food poisoning yeah. for a huge show. Oh, God, and so instead yeah. of going out on stage, he just brought the microphone into the toilet and wrapped his ass out whilst diarrheaing backstage. <laughs> so that's always an option. That, that is yeah. always an option. You know, uh, like a long XLR <laughs> cable yeah. just, just naked off to the side. I think the problem, though, like with rapping, because there's a beat, <laughs> yeah. that would probably, you could probably turn the mic down enough yeah. that you're not going to pick up, up the, the diary. But yeah. I think that because you're talking, yeah. and it'll be to, The thing as well is, like, with, with a rap song, you, you're in a rhythm or whatever. Yeah. If I'm talking, there'll be times where I have to just, like, <laughs> stop. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And you'll yeah, yeah. just know. Yeah. You'll just know. Just I, like, oh, yeah, 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 Professor X or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> like the, the, it might not even be like that non-violent in yeah. a way because it might just be like yeah 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 and so Xavier be like oh my god <laughs> 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 and he probably say something like this <laughs> oh, I gotta take my shirt off oh, I gotta take my shirt off you just hear like the sound of like in the middle of a riff I go <laughs> and then donk as I hit my head <laughs> like he squeezed so hard he blacked out yeah, yeah fuck. fair enough um, I think it's uh-huh. funny as well to imagine being at stage because sometimes it's diarrhea chat with the BS boys yeah. sometimes if you've got a real bad stomach you're letting out rancid farts yeah. Yeah. and obviously the crowd couldn't tell but uh, you and James uh, on stage would be good uh, and you're like Jackson it's happening I'm <laughs> it's pulling happening. out my bingo card and I'm ticking <laughs> yeah. it off it's happening I can tell it's happening <laughs> okay well that's a good one to put in there because yep, yep, yep. it's probably going to happen too. okay yeah. so we've covered the first couple of days yeah. we'll yeah. pretty much just be loitering around London mm-hmm. being like, man, mm-hmm. I hope my body clock adjusts. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and it will. Hopefully. I f- feel like that it takes a couple of days. For so. me, it takes about a week, which is yeah. unfortunate. Because mm-hmm. it takes about a week. We're there for like about two and a half weeks. So yeah. a week, my body clock's adjusted. A week and a half to have a normal UK body clock. Back Come here. back here. Terrible. Yeah. One yeah. more week. I always find that it, time. Yeah. I think it's because over there, I'm just forced to do more stuff. Yeah. Mm. Where when I come back here, jet lag always fucks me up for longer. Yes, me mm. too, actually. That's yeah, it, it's that wonderful thing. Like when we're here, it's the say, uh, like, oh, okay, I got a migraine. I don't feel good or yeah. whatever. Boys, just do something else. Or don't come in. I'm taking a day off. Yeah. Yep. Whereas when you're on tour, it's you can't the, do that. Yeah. I've woken up. I vomited at least four times. Mm-hmm. <sighs> okay, well, look, fuck yeah, it. Let's, uh, let's, let's, let's do a we've show. We've got to do a show. It's fine. Let's go for it. Let's yeah. do this, boys. Absolutely. Yeah, you just got well, to kind of, yeah, you, you get push through. We are lucky. Power, yeah. We are lucky in our in uh, one sense that our, our jet lag just looks like we're really tired and maybe our stomach's a little upset. Yeah. yeah. Migraines and di- uh, vomiting. Yeah. Not on the me and Jackson. No, that's true. Yeah. Jet yeah. lag wave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very, very true. Very true. Uh, so yeah, then we go from London to Edinburgh. That's right. Yep. You got uh, yeah two shows in Edinburgh. On um, the, do we uh, fly uh, from the... London to? No, boys, you're taking a train. Whoa, Whoa. No. Yes. up top. Yes, yeah. I'll, um, I'll double check. I think I'm pretty sure you're taking a train. Before I was like, wait, did we discuss this? And you're dri- no, you're taking a train. I'm pretty yeah. sure. You're taking yeah, a we train. did. Do, we did discuss this. It was driving train or plane. Yeah, mm-hmm. and. I was like, the drive and the train are pretty similar. And then mm. I realized it was because I was looking at like 1 30 a.m. Yeah. Edinburgh time. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And then yeah, when yeah. we adjusted it to regular time, it was like a yeah. three hour difference. And, and I was like, was, yeah, let's yeah. take the train. And it was driving. How, how far? Oh, it's a big drive. It's like yeah, eight hours. Yeah. yeah. So I believe, yes, we've, already, we've actually we've already booked the train. Oh, my tickets. God. That's so, yes, so you've exciting. got uh, dude, you your love train. Being on I love being on a train, dude. To, I to feel, Edinburgh. I don't know. I don't really feel that different about being on a train as I feel about being just in a building. Yeah, but you're moving in a train. Yeah, but yeah. like that you doesn't get up and walk around. Go to get a snack, brother. You can do that in a building. I suppose. I guess. Can't look out the window in a building. Yes, you can. <laughs> what? There's a window right there. You yeah, can... but stuff's not going past. Sometimes so there much is. shit happens outside <laughs> this window. <laughs> a lot true. happens outside this it window. It's dangerous my dude. to have that window open. Yeah, yeah. So much to see. Yeah. I mean, not yeah. right now. No, <laughs> no. Right now, it's two parked cars that yeah. I can see, and that's yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, um, there's a person. <laughs> see? <laughs> it's, all, it's happening. A person walked past doing nothing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so the, the I believe, I mean, I've got to double check all this after yeah. uh, this uh, yeah. uh, the episode's done. Because I know hey, we've hey, kept some it... tickets in reserve. Yeah, we've ke- sure. kept some things just in case some things go awry or some people need certain things. And blah, 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 blah. So there is maybe some tickets that might go on sale for the shows that have been sold out. That okay. don't That's hold exciting. me to that. Um, but as it stands to, as as now, the, uh, uh, the the 18th of September is, has been has sold out. But nice. the uh, the 17th, there is a couple tickets left, about a handful, about uh, 12, I think, yeah, as man. of recording. So. You, there'll be 12 of you out there with nothing to do on, <laughs> on that a, night. On a live in Monday Edinburgh. or Tuesday night in yeah. Edinburgh. Yeah. What else are you doing? What else are you doing? On a Tuesday, Tuesday night. night. Tuesday night. What are you doing? What are you doing? 
what, talking to your family and Eating friends? shortbread. Going yeah. up to the King's Mile. That was called King's Mile. Thinking, yeah. looking, at, looking at Arthur's Look, seat yeah. and being like, why do people keep climbing that? Yeah. <laughs> going out there, from there. Going to the castle. Maybe look, look looking at when the when the next tattoo is happening. Yes, yeah. that's right. Um, Listening for tattoos. Being happy that Edinburgh Fringe is over, so your <laughs> shitty's gone back to normal. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah only on. to be ruined once more <laughs> by yeah. us. By, by these now lovely that you've just yeah, Edinburgh Fringe is finished, and you you don't have to see any live comedy. Why not come see some live comedy? Yeah, come and it's on. at the Monkey Barrel. Yeah, that's the most apt name for a place that we <laughs> yeah, could perform exactly. in. Uh, how long are we in Edinburgh? Uh, I think you're in Edinburgh, so I think you. I'll double check exactly we get when you arrive. We a van in Edinburgh. Whoa. But yes, you, you do pick up a van um, in in Edinburgh, mm. and I believe you're there for a, either a day either side, or maybe a couple okay. days either side. Nice. Or actually, from the look of it, I think you might be there for a while. Holy maybe, mackerel! Maybe, maybe even three days after. Whoa, the three last days show. in Edinburgh to do what we want, dude. <sighs> that's exciting. We I could climb Edinburgh. off the seat. <laughs> yeah, we will. Mm. Do you reckon you'll climb off the seat again? Do you reckon we'll put that on the bingo? It'll card? depend on if James is keen on it and yeah. I reckon he will because yeah. he's a fit man and yeah. likes exercise. Yeah. Well, you might be able to go near that cliff again. I love yeah. to look off that cliff and be like, I could, this could be it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't call, wa- the I don't... call of the void has never <laughs> yeah. been closer for JD. I'll be like, I don't want to do it, but but what if? What if? And then I have to go back to James and be like, we'll do it. It's just a two man show. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> he did it. <laughs> <laughs> should we call uh, someone? No. So we no. Should, do you, uh, should we just no. cancel the rest of the. No, 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 no. no, no, no. Hey, he's been if talking we don't about process this it, we'll think about it. It'll be fine. James, James, yeah. James. Let me tell you, this is not a surprise. <laughs> yeah. He's always running his mouth about jumping off Arthur's seat. I'm not surprised. Let's go. Yeah. yeah. So, come on, man. What's good in Edinburgh? There's a bunch. There's little. Th- not little Edinburgh. Edinburgh. There's downtown Edinburgh and up Edinburgh. Yeah. And Edinburgh's divided in two. There's that tower I liked to climb. There was a tower you liked yeah. to climb. Last time we were yeah. there. Yeah. Um, let's what see. else did we do? There's the castle, which There's is good castle. to see. It's very cool. Maybe there'll uh, be a tattoo while we're there. Yeah, yeah. You can go on like a, like a, I believe, like a whiskey, get in a barrel, go on the whiskey tour, I think. Get in a what barrel? The yeah, hell? there's like a tour there where you, I think you get in a barrel. Was it? <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, dude. We got to get in a barrel, dude. Yeah, okay. So put that on there. Don't right. let's not connect it to the tool. Let's just say the boys get, get in a barrel yeah, yeah. in some capacity. Yeah. Um, was it the possible. Tower of London or was it Edinburgh where they had the hanging simulator? Uh <laughs> it was a ride. I don't uh, know. I didn't do it. If uh did you do it also yeah. over there? I don't know. I don't know. We went to the underground it, tour. I yeah, think that's it, true, we did. I think it was the Tower of London. Yeah, it was at the end of the underground tour, remember? Mm. You sit on the thing and they drop you. No, uh-huh. I don't remember this. Well, yeah, I think Edinburgh is where you've probably got the most like downtime. That's, That's all free time. So I yeah, I, I think yeah, we, you probably get get in a barrel. What else yeah. you reckon? What so else I, don't know, do I don't know if James has been to Edinburgh. I don't think so. Oh, so that makes sense to why we've stuff. done. Yeah, yeah. Like, well, if he hasn't been to Edinburgh, <laughs> yeah. that means these boys are yeah. fucking climbing We're off going the seat. Off Arthur's seat. We're going to the castle. Where... And now that I know that Arthur's seat is almost certainly on the cards, will I pack appropriate footwear for it? No. <laughs> no. Man. The whole way up, no baby. Grip, bitch. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna put somewhere here. Uh, JD hears call of the void. <laughs> yeah. Not succumbs. Not just, Not just, just hears it. Just, just hears, hears it. it. Do you think I'll put you in a situation where you'll slip over again <laughs> and I'll have to save your life? Was like that? Last time. That was Edinburgh. That was Edinburgh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was coming yeah, down yeah, from I the know, tower. Yeah, I know. I know a shortcut. <laughs> oh, a, a, a muddy sheer face. Did yeah. you do this when it wasn't raining? Yeah, yeah, yeah. dude. I'm down the bottom. <laughs> I'd never. Jackson, I have. Remember, no grip, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <Whoa! laughs> I've never seen so like not yeah. I've never seen someone eat so much shit in such like a short amount of time. <laughs> well, I just yeah. had to, like, over and over and over again. <laughs> I just had to accept it. I was like, uh, I'm just gonna keep falling over. You come so close to a, a cliff edge. <laughs> yeah, it's like, like literally it, cliff edge, like thorns. <laughs> I want to say like half a meter less than. Yeah, yeah. it was Fuck, crazy. Dude. It was awesome. Yeah, what are we? Imagine I've never I just, seen what? a man. <laughs> Yeah, and it was like giggling, a, yeah. giggling so close to death. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, it was like about a five story drop. I might have been fine. <laughs> yeah, 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 you wouldn't have died no. necessarily. Yeah. Necessarily, I, I mean, maybe, maybe but maybe. probably not. Yeah. Um, I wonder if we still have that footage somewhere. We, we do. We definitely. It do. is funny. It is funny. <laughs> uh, let's see. You got to think like I, I, the, the traditional like touristy mm. things of like yeah. I get to try some haggis. I would love to try haggis. Have you had haggis no. yet? No. But my parents had it when they lived in Scotland, and they sort of said it was awesome. Mm-hmm. How have you not had haggis? I don't know. I feel like I had haggis straight away. 
When? When? In, when? When? <laughs> when? When? Edinburgh Fringe. When we were in Edinburgh for two I, weeks. I don't think I had haggis. I don't think wow. I've had haggis. Put down Jackson. They eat haggis. Boy. Well, yeah. that could be tied to the Jackson shit band. <laughs> yeah, that's hey. true. That's true. Yeah. I'd like to try haggis. I, yeah. I had a lot of black pudding when I went last time. Mm. That was really good. Maybe I'll go to that cafe where they did pulled pork and mm. maple syrup pancakes. That was really awesome. Mm. You love a meat and sweet. Oh, it was so good, dude. And I, I love a Edinburgh? meat and green. Was that in, in, uh, it was in Edinburgh. So I know you had that meal almost like the same again. I had it like three days in a <laughs> row. Is that also where we were at, went to that chicken and waffles place? Yeah. And we were there with Wings! The we could go to Wings! We can go to Wings! Oh, wings. oh, wings. oh my God. Oh, that's okay. so exciting. Fuck. Wings is awesome, dude. We're gonna Last do the... time we were there, I was not eating meat. And I, bro. I, bro... Bro, Bro, we went with people that were like, yeah, I don't eat meat except here at Wings. That <laughs> yeah. should have been a sign. Well, should have been a sign. Count. Yeah, oh, man. Should've been. Like, the I'm vegetarian so option was delicious. Yeah, but, yeah. man, seeing you guys sucking down those wings. They were like 40 oh, sauces. Oh, man, yeah. I've never oh, been so love jealous. Sauce. I love sauce, bro. Yeah. I mean, I'm not even going to write that. That's a lock. Yeah, yeah. it's a lock. It's a lock. Uh... Mm. Yeah. What I'm trying to think of what else is in Edinburgh. Do you remember when we went to the chicken and waffles place while well, you're remembering? Mm. And we were there with a bunch of fans, and then some guys started like yelling and pointing at me, just like strangers. Yeah. And I was like, man, like this is, you know, I, I don't want to get into an altercation. You know, there's fans here. Obviously, I'm kind of responsible for them. So I went over to the guys and I was like, can I help you? And they were like, naughty. <laughs> 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 you look like naughty man. And I was like, okay. And they were like, can we get a photo with you, naughty? And I was like, okay. <laughs> you got a hat, naughty? <laughs> they took a photo with me and called me naughty. <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> I hope that happens again. <laughs> Me too. Yeah, I was just yeah. like, I was like, oh man, like, am I gonna have to like, I don't know what? And yeah. then uh, no, they were just mocking just me. Got, yeah, for and then to my look. face. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, which is honestly, I'll take. Mm. Um, Fair enough. Hmm. Uh, Jackson, you'll probably drink too many cocktails too quickly. Yes. Jackson drinks too many cocktails, gets very drunk. Oh, but yeah. then still and then sober. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Yo, man, I forget how still you... I mean, I've I not been drinking you. with you. Still. I haven't been drinking in a long time. Mm. I've not been drinking with you for such a long time that I forgot how still you it's get. It's the best, dude. When I get very drunk, I just... Sit down, sit gotta go down, still. Gotta go still. He goes still just mode ahead. and just stares stare at... Stare ahead, uh, but smiling. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm like... Things are pretty yeah. good right now. You, you'll catch him just staring at, like, some of his friends. Sometimes he's just there very still looking at, like, you know, someone, yeah. just myself, yeah. did, Adam, and he's just there just I'm happy. He's just happy. Yeah. He's happy because he drank four cocktails in 45 <laughs> yeah, seconds. Exactly. That's what it does to me, dude. It slows me down. Yeah. Stills mm. me up. Um, <laughs> what else? It's so weird because we spent two weeks in yeah. Edinburgh. We did heaps of stuff, yeah. but what did we do? I think we just, like, kind of fucked around. Yeah. yeah. A lot of tooling around. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 It's like there's uh, some great places to kind of go see. There's like, oh, the food up there. Oh, dude, it's delicious. Love The breakfast, though. Yeah. Oh, shit. (laughs) (laughs) Terrible, dude. I still remember that one time. um, It's like probably the first time we Mm. were in Edinburgh. Yeah, like going out because there was the last leg was Edinburgh. Yeah. Yeah. Towards the end. And yeah, nothing but terrible. Like, I don't know what happened to London where they looked at um, an egg and went like, let's fuck it up. But they (laughs) just did. Um, And it's impressive. Yeah. And I remember the first time going in like, uh, if you're on the lookout, uh, like a barista or whatever, and you hear that Melbourneian accent, you're like, oh, it's going to be good. It's going to be good. good." Um, I went to a place and it was like recommended on Google. Like, oh yeah, yeah. this one actually do good egg breakfast, but Melbourne style, blah, 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 blah. Has avocado on toast. Like, oh, pretty good. Mm. Went there and um, the the, the, the thick Scottish brogue was Mm. like, they said something. I don't know mm. what. And I'm a polite man, and half the time when it comes to most interactions, I just smile and go, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. of course. And the question uh, this time was, do you want mustard on no, your eggs? No, yeah, do you want sweet mustard? And I, I had no idea. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And they did. And I was, it, was, it was a perfect meal. It was a beautifully cooked egg. Like It was like poached and like, it was runny, not yep. like hard-boiled poached, yep. which seems to be the norm, at least when we were going. Um, and it was like, it was beautiful. It was, everything was so nice. And then it was just drenched in this sweet fucking mustard. Yeah, <laughs> and it was no. awful. Yeah. It was all, you couldn't even scrape it off. It was just drenched in it. <laughs> <laughs> and then the next day I went in and I knew what to say. They said, no, 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 no don't break my eggs. None of that. 
I want good eggs. And yeah. they looked at me almost perplexed, puzzled, but yeah, no. Eggs. No it's mustard? Guy doesn't want sweet mustard. I want his eggs. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Sorry, but you fucked in the head. Yeah, you fucked up, mate. You got rocks for brains. You don't want sweet mustard. So, so we're going to wander around Edinburgh and be like, what the fuck? Yeah. And then we jump in a tour van. Yep. Yeah, yeah, and then we drive to Manchester. So JD, you have your license. James has his license. Jackson, have you? Passenger Princess. Yeah, you'll be in the back seat with your noise cancelling headphones on seeing the same one lyric of a song over and yeah, over yeah, to yeah. yourself. Yeah. Maybe I'll be in the back of the van yeah. and it'll be like a big white van and I won't be strapped down. Yeah, that'll be good. Turn really hard to <laughs> be into the wall. That's yeah. ideal. Like yeah. a 1970s serial killer. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Do love you. Ten years in. Ten years and still and yet, still and yet, poning each other's and yet, tents. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, like Jackson yeah. still doesn't have his license have his slash license. Yeah. Clint yeah. slash brown aerial. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. yeah. It's nice to know that we haven't developed past this. Yeah, haven't changed. You only and you've only moved further away from the studio. In Jackson's defense. He did fail his driver's test once and then never tried it again. Yeah, exactly. If at first you don't succeed, <laughs> give That's, up. Yeah. <laughs> you, you did enough to get people off your back. Yeah. And then, whoop. That c- couldn't be helped. <laughs> yeah, dude. Here we are. Well, then, yeah. So, uh, Passenger Princess in tow, mm-hmm. you arrive in Manchester and you're performing on a, uh, on the Saturday and the Sunday. On yeah. The 21st oh. and 22nd. Double and I uh, believe the 21st is sold uh, out. Is sold out. Mm-hmm. And let me quickly double check because I think the next comment is going to be great for me because I believe also the 20 se- is also sold out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Both shows. Uh, once again, uh, after this episode I, uh, is, mm-hmm. I will definitely be looking in to see uh, if we can free up some. Some tickets yeah, here and sure, there, but sure, sure. Yeah. Good, good luck. I hey, guess. what can you do? Uh, what do you think we'll do in Manchester? Well, I'm definitely going to ask someone how they're feeling about the Oasis reunion. Yeah, good idea. Mm-hmm. You reckon we'll watch Manchester by the sea? Mm, no. no. <laughs> okay, fair enough. <laughs> Although I do really want to see that film, but yeah. Casey Affleck is a woman. Oh, that's true. I forgot yeah. Casey Affleck was in it. That's right. That's yeah. And I think that that movie in particular, you need to feel pathos towards it. Yeah, him, hard to do. Which mm, is hard to yeah. do. But it is an Oscar winner. Yeah, wow, well, yeah. And famously, the Oscars have never gotten it wrong. Yeah, yeah Green that's Book, true. Uh, <clears throat> Shakespeare in Love, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, well, okay. Crash. Crash! Dude, you, okay, you got two films. Yeah. You got one. Uh, which is um, a depiction of a world war mm-hmm. when veterans watched it, they cried, they yeah. weeped, it kind of brought them mm-hmm. back. They were like, man, this is a, a very, very you know, accurate you know, yeah. depiction of what it was like. Um, heart, you know, like, you know, pulling yeah. the heartstrings, Absolutely. very emotional, all about like, you know, what it means to try and get there to rescue. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. Yeah. Damon, uh, by one of the- or. Shakespeare in Love. Yeah. Whoa, and like, hang on. But the war movie is also directed by one of the most celebrated directors of all time. And who directed Shakespeare in Love? Hmm. <laughs> Sold. That one gets yeah. the Oscar. Yeah, really good yeah. question. Because I don't know that one gets Ang the Oscar. Ang Lee? Yeah. Could be. No. Could be. Was it Ang Lee? Um, oh, no. Well, either way, it was a Weinstein uh, yeah. uh, marketing campaign. Mm, uh, good stuff. Haven't heard anything bad about that company. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so uh, I reckon I'm going to I'm going to put here that yeah. JD will buy some Oasis merch. Oh, I think that's very not in possible. Manchester. I'm not fucking made of money. <laughs> I don't know. I'd be better off buying Oasis stuff here. I don't it know. Was, I don't know. You're going to see. Some, I look. I reckon you're going to see something. Yeah, it's a speculation. It's going to see something. You're going to be in Manchester. You're going to be thinking about Oasis. You're going to have Oasis brain. Yeah. On and, the drive there, and this I think goes into the Oasis merch. On the drive there. You and James will put, because you'll be in the front two seats, yeah. Yeah. you will put Oasis on for the whole trip, and by the time you get there, you will have, quote, Oasis fever, Yeah, I've, and you'll buy it's some happened, Oasis fever has happened to me before. Yeah. I we, know, Liam, we know you're, you're culpable. Yeah, I'm, yes. I'm capable of it. Yeah. Saw Liam Gallagher live once and was yeah. like, oh, this is good. <laughs> I, I got some, it. Yeah, their albums are really good. Uh, Shakespeare in Love was directed by John Madden. What? You the know, footballer? The, no, the director of the best exotic Marigold Hotel and the second best exotic Marigold Hotel. Remember those movies? I do. Dude. A bunch of old, old people, people went mm. crazy for them. <laughs> yeah. Some movies are old people movies, which is pretty funny. <clears throat> he also mm. directed Proof and Kill Shot. And is Proof the one with Rusty? Maybe. Is Proof... Proof is... Not with Rusty. Damn. It's with. It's actually his reunion with Gwyneth Paltrow. Oh, Gwyneth Paltrow, Anthony Hopkins, Jake Gyllenhaal, and Hope Davis. What? Huh. Huh. What What's, are you thinking of? Uh, uh, something. I think it's proof where Rusty they go. Some someone gets kidnapped in South America. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's like uh, Body of Proof. Maybe is that a film? Body of Proof is the name of a movie. Is that with Rusty? Body Could of be. Wait, he, body, uh, wait, body, body of, of lies. Body of 
Lies? With Body Rusty? Of, Body of Lies is Rusty, but that's directed by Ridley Scott. Okay. Might be thinking of that one. Yeah. Is, uh, yeah, is that about someone getting kidnapped and they got to find uh, information? Like, about the, the proof uh, that they're alive or some biz? Could be. Maybe. Maybe. It's set in the Middle East. Uh, okay, okay, maybe not. Doesn't sound like yeah, your movie. Sound like what I'm thinking. Yeah. Mm. Mm. What do you reckon we'll do? Mm. What What did we do last time we were in Manchester? Because mm. we've been to Manchester before. Uh, I feel like that Manchester is going to be somewhere like London, where I'll probably hit up like record stores and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, I feel yeah. like we do stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Go shopping. Mm. Yeah, shopping. Uh, pubs. Yeah, yeah. Pubs, mm. dude. There's going to be big. I feel town like Manchester is going to have good pubs. Yeah, yeah. Is Manchester, the one with the like big moat. Or big canals or whatever. Or That's is that what I have in, Are you thinking of the Thames? No. <laughs> I have in my I head Manchester is the, the place we went once where there was canals. a crane that was a house. <laughs> a crane that was a house. And it was on the river, and you could stay in the crane. And the crane that was, was Bristol. House. That was Bristol. Fuck. Bristol's also the canal. Okay. Yeah. Well, we don't know yeah. what's going on in Manchester. Isn't Manchester then. the one where they got all the canals? No, not that's, the Thames. But no, that's Bristol. No. Bristol is a big canal. Yeah. Bristol's got the big canal, but Are you Manchester... thinking of where they film Skins? No, Bristol? I've never seen Skins in my life. Uh... I'm thinking about when me and you, because we went there early, we had to walk around for ages, and we ended up going through tunnels. Oh! Yeah, he remembers. Yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. Just... we got to take you in one of those tunnels, dude. <laughs> oh, dude, I love tunnels. Now, I love Manchester tunnels almost as much as I love trains. That could have been Birmingham. Yeah. What's in Manchester? Let's go to their Wikipedia page for Manchester. <laughs> what is okay. in Manchester? Um, <laughs> the worker, the worker bee. bee. Is there a bee? <laughs> <laughs> the famous Manchester There is a bee. lot of... Can- there's the Bridgewater Canal. Mm-hmm. Maybe Manchester... Is Manchester where I ate... Six cheese big cheeseburgers? No. Nah. No. Nah. Okay. I think that was Nottingham? Maybe. Yeah, yeah, Manchester was way too... The shows there were rowdy. You would yeah, not okay. have had a chance to, to eat, eat seven full cheeseburgers. Stop. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, fair enough. Industrial Revolution. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's funny to go to the Industrial Revolution to see if anything reminds us of what's in Manchester. Just Google what's in Manchester. Yeah. Uh, what <laughs> to do in yeah, what's Manchester? Yeah, what's it to do in Manchester? Yeah, let's like find out. Do we have much downtime? Uh, not really, not but still. Not really, I don't Well, here's think, the 15 uh, best things to do in Manchester. According to oh, yeah. TripAdvisor.com. Mm-hmm. Fun and games. Okay. Wait, yeah. this isn't a list. I think you might arrive in Manchester like Friday, like the day, like the, either the day or the night. Either way, depending yeah. how much of, like long a drive is, and then you maybe I think you leave on the Monday anyway. So it's not a, not a huge amount of time. Yeah, I to s- be honest. Yeah, yeah. Manchester. Well, maybe we'll, you got some of the like either during the day. Yeah, before the shows. I think Man- was Manchester a place where I had a lovely like Scandinavian breakfast. Whoa, I hope so. Because it was like uh, uh it's like eggs was really nice, and they had like a bit of feta and like broccolini grilled. Ooh, it was lovely. That sounds awesome. A toast with that. Um, yeah. Look, Manchester. I feel like we're not gonna have enough time to do anything. No, but it, yeah, especially when he's consumed. Uh, JD's consumed. He's got by, Oasis, um, Oasis fever. fever. Yeah. yeah, I think I'll just yeah. be hanging out. I think Manchester. Will I'll get the- sucked into like maybe there'll be like a Man U and Man City <laughs> football game happening, yeah. and I'll get sucked into um, yeah. hooliganism. Mm. <laughs> no. One can hope. I I think Manchester is going to be a city where I get up in the morning and just kind of ramble around the city for most of the day, yeah. and then meet up for that. You're looking up football matches. You are going to go hooligan mode. Oh no. Uh, what dates are we in? Manchester. Manchester. Uh, well, you're, perf- you're, you know, you're performing on the 21st and the 22nd. Mm-hmm. So I okay. think either, either so, side. Okay, you might so be, great uh, news for hooliganism. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Manchester. Man United aren't playing in Manchester that okay. night. Because yes. if there was something happening that Friday night, there's a good chance you could go go to it. Okay. Does football matches happen on a Friday night? I, I don't only know. assume yes. Yeah. Uh, Friday night seems like a good night for hooligans. Seems like a football night. Right? Yeah, and it seems like a good night to get rowdy. Okay, so well, Man City. Uh, no, wait, hang on. Saturday night's all right for fighting. Yeah, <laughs> that's Man right, City famously. and Man U are both playing just either side of uh, <laughs> us being there, so we're safe. Yeah, we're yeah. safe from hooliganism. Just. Well, just. we have. Uh, what, what are like uniquely British foods? Spice bags? We can have a spice bag? <laughs> I think that might be Irish, bag. but uh, either that or Scottish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We could have a spice bag in Edinburgh. I think you get a spice. There's a place in uh, Melbourne you get a spice bag. Well, that's true, but I want an authentic well, fair enough. UK spice bag. Yeah. Like that guy on TikTok who yeah. goes, oh, on a Saturday night. That guy. <laughs> <laughs> Love a spice bag on a Saturday night. Anyway, we mm. might do that. Might go spice bag. Um, okay, mm-hmm. after Manchester, what's next? Well, then you get to Birmingham. 
Okay. On the, on the 24th. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I believe you then have a, like a maybe a day either side. Uh, what the uh, fuck is this building? What the hell? Looks like a fucking... Oh, that's is a that Cabri Berlin? world. <laughs> yeah. Cabri world? No, yeah, but that's not what I got distracted uh, yeah. by. It's circling through stuff and I can't stop it. Whoa, I want to go on these things. <laughs> you found a bunch of awesome stuff. I just looked at pictures of Birmingham. Yeah. Whoa, Birmingham's Big Ben. Got, <laughs> big Ben. <laughs> go see Big Ben in Birmingham. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Will we actually, and this is for while we're in London, if we get a chance... Famously, do every time we go to London, you got to find Big Ben and give it the finger. Yeah, I Say, fucking hey, hate fuck that you, Big Ben. So, do we want to? I mean, I, that feels like a short bet, but write it down. Yeah, okay, finger, give Big Ben the, the business. Finger, yeah, the, the business. Yeah, exactly. finger, finger Big, Big ben. ben. Hell yeah, done. All right, they'll put that one down. Okay, um, okay, okay. And then yeah, you've got a uh, uh, Birmingham. Mm-hmm. Yep. on on the on the twenty fourth, uh, I believe at the Glee Club. Okay, and there is a few tickets available from our website i believe mm-hmm. um yeah again once again maybe maybe 10 okay <laughs> if maybe I can 10 maybe 10 tickets read my uh website correctly and i might not be yeah, yeah fair enough be. i'm gonna see what there is to do in birmingham mm. uh, Birmingham. we gotta head to broad street i think okay mm-hmm. what's happening there nightlife oh <laughs> okay I think. What about if I do the Cotswolds full day tour? Oh. Yeah, just get lost to the city for a day. <laughs> well, I think mm. the Cotswolds is like a is mm-hmm. like the country, maybe. Mm. If I've got a full day either side, I could go to the Cotswolds. It wouldn't verify yeah. my uh, d- device. Um, yeah. Yeah. So Birmingham, uh, if you want, if you haven't already uh, purchased tickets mm-hmm. for that, uh, you can. Yes, go to our website or I believe the Glee Club. Uh, so they had some tickets. We had some tickets, and we've got um, yeah about uh, I think ten to twelve left. Mm-hmm. I'm not quite sure how many the Glee Club have. If if they say they're sold out. Uh, go to our website, but if our website says we're sold out, go to the Glee Club. <laughs> Maybe you'll get uh, a handful here and there. It was a confusing deal. I there'll be tickets somewhere, pro- possibly. Oh, wait, wait, I think wait. I found should out. Should we, we go to Cadbury World? I yes. think. Yeah, I think we should. Um, but also, look at fucking Fred of Frog. Yeah, but dude, we could also take the Peaky Blinders, Blinders tour. <laughs> There's a Peaky Blinders tour, a TV show me, neither me nor this have ever seen, but we know. It's a funny name. Yeah, and they're the fucking Peaky Blinders. They're the Peaky Blinders. They put knives in their hat. Yeah. They do put knives in their hat. Uh, put Go to Cadbury World on there, I think. Yeah. I think there's a good chance we'll go to Cadbury yeah, World. Do you get free chocolate? If they don't give you free chocolate, what Cadbury the FC. They got a football club? What the they hell? They got a football club? What, what the, the hell? fuck? Okay. Cu- yeah. Whoa, enter the competition. You could win a day to remember. Whoa, that's a band. I get a whole band? <laughs> yeah, a whole dude. day to remember? You get now. a whole day to remember if you enter the competition. Winaday.cadbury.co.uk. Where do I live? <laughs> Great Britain. <laughs> yeah, we'll be there mm. for, for, for the day to remember. Hmm. There's over mm. 200,000 unforgettable, unforgettable prizes, prizes and rewards. rewards. That's a lot of prizes. Worth doing, dude. Mm. Wow. And uh, well, then after after Birmingham, I yeah. believe a day of wonderful rest uh-huh. uh, before uh, getting on a, a a plane to come back to beautiful Melbourne. Okay. Uh, uh, Anything good happening in Melbourne? Here, I'll look it up. Let's oh, see. We, well, I can tell you what happens the day we land. Yeah. We land at 5 a.m., Yep. Uh, on grand final day. <laughs> oh, oh So there'll be stuff Bruh. happening in Melbourne. Yeah. Yeah, I was going to say, so you, yeah, you leave in the evening uh, okay. to, to Abu Dhabi, which is only like a, a beautiful seven-hour flight. Oh, nice. Uh, to, to arrive. And then we get the thing that we were talking uh, about going yep. there, but that's yeah, okay. You, you arrive at like 8 a.m., uh, you know, uh, the next day. Mm-hmm. Uh, you, you Yes, you leave. It's 8 a.m. plus a day. That's nice. Um, and then, yeah, you then... Okay, so then a couple of hours lay off. I'm like, yeah. oh no, 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 no. Then a couple of hours. Then at nine, uh, not ten a.m. Yeah. Uh, then you then you fly a, a wonderful thirteen hours. Yeah, huh? to arrive five a.m. Melbourne really fix that jet lag. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Five a.m. Five a.m. Melbourne is Saturday the twenty eighth, right? Yeah. yeah. Anyone want to pick us up from the airport? Uh, <laughs> maybe. No, we'll get it. We'll, we'll get figure it out. I don't want to I'm make like, anyone wake up that early. Well, the thing is, it's five a.m. Sure, like, I'll generally be up around about five or six a.m. Usually, yeah. you have about an hour or so. Uh, you know, getting through customs and all mm, that. Bullshit. That's true. Well, customs is chill now, especially because we live in Australia. Customs yeah, is usually very yeah. quick. Yes, Australian it's customs. Uh, international? Is easy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Really? I recently came back huh. from Thailand and it was 
a breeze. You scan, you get your e-passport, yeah. you jam it in the machine, yeah. they go, Especially welcome if, home, yeah, cobble. Yeah, yeah. Especially at 5 a.m. as well. Yeah. I've had people They're not going to want to talk to us. We don't want to talk yeah. to them. Exactly. Oh, no, no. I've had people coming from like you know, interstate, mm. uh, and it's like you know they arrive at a certain time, and it's like usually about an hour later just because of delays. And yeah, stuff. yeah. That baggage happen. collection is where they fuck you with yeah. stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But 5 a.m., I think you boys might be Customs good. are easy. So. Sometimes I've been waved through customs before. They yeah. shouldn't do that. <laughs> Last time I went through customs, um, uh, they, we, we were uh, chosen to, to line up, and uh, they, I, they picked me to put some little like candy or whatever, or like um, some illicit substance in my pocket, so that a dog could Whoa. sniff me and bark at me. That's it was cool. Great. I That's got to good. be like, I want to pat the dog. And they're like, don't pat the dog. It's <laughs> working. I'm like, but I want to pat the dog. <laughs> I don't care. Good, it's a good dog. <laughs> it's a good dog. He found me snuggling all these drugs. And then they, yeah, yeah. unloaded a full round into Joel's <laughs> Yeah, Don't touch the dog. Yeah, coming back from Thailand, the thing, I, going to Thailand, the thing I noticed is you're right. Baggage claim in Australia is crazy. Mm-hmm. Every single airport, because we went to Bangkok, then Chiang Mai, then back mm-hmm. from Chiang Mai to Bangkok, and then back home. Every baggage claim, it's like that. Yeah. You mm-hmm. land and there's your bag and you go. Melbourne, you're there for like half an hour. Yeah. yeah. Waiting. Standing waiting. around with your thumb up your ass. Yeah, yeah exactly. You're like, oh, I'll go get a coffee. You mm-hmm. get a coffee, you finish your coffee, still nothing. Still no, no bag. Yeah. Now you just got like that hot coffee feeling yeah. of like, you're like, oh, I'm a bit hot. And you get that, that sort of stress in the back of your mind where you're like, mm-hmm. have they forgotten my bag? Good. I'm so tired. There's I don't nothing to... good in it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They can have it, dude. Yeah. Like, look, they lose your bag. Yeah, oh, I'll, I'll be fine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They well, can. I have to buy new pants. <laughs> <laughs> you might as well travel with no bag, really. Yeah. Buy everything there. And then just lose it. <laughs> <laughs> well. <laughs> mm, I, I'd say if you've got to do that, like, like you have a backpack that you could put in an overhead locker, like, in t- you know, yeah, yeah. But what carry if, what if, on. Then you no. lose that. Mm. How you uh. <laughs> Someone steals it. Yeah, you leave it in the toilet or whatever. You take it with you to the toilet on the plane and it gets sucked out. <laughs> but you don't tell anyone. Yeah, because you're, you're embarrassed. You come out wet because <laughs> it's spread up a lot of water. Yeah, Even though there's right. no water in yeah. it, really. Mm-hmm. And you sit back down and you sit there, you're like, didn't you have that with your bag? No. Yeah. <laughs> what bag? I didn't bring a bag. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing at all. I don't know what you're talking I didn't about. Bring it back. Yeah, um, <laughs> I didn't need it anyway. Well, speaking of, I guess the plane ride there and the plane and the plane mm. ride back. So I, I actually don't know because uh, uh, what what uh, you know, James, cause James was in charge of booking his own. Flight. Yeah, sure, sure. And sure. I believe uh, very early on he was mentioning something about maybe him having enough points mm-hmm. to potentially uh, not Go join business. you yeah. two boys with an economy. Yeah, the ape what, class. <laughs> yeah. What I also like about that is if he. That means that I think, with again, I don't know, but yeah. I think with business class, if you do that, does it allow him access to the lounge oh. and not you two? If James yeah. is in the lounge Which, whilst we're sitting like, you know, like one of those like weird couches, not couches, like the sets of seats and yeah, everything, yeah, yeah. bags like this, yeah. staring at his James is like, oh yeah, we'll have a champagne. Yeah, thank you very yeah, much. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, yeah, well, well, oh, yeah, have a look. Okay. okay. Oh, massage yeah. chair. How Ooh. nice. Mm. Massage chair, buddy. <laughs> it might just be like, oh, yeah, uh, uh, actual massage. Yeah, yeah, free, complimentary. And, I'm like, and then I get a. I'm going to kill Mr. Sunday. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fair enough. Fair, fair, fair. And then they go, oh, I can, I can have a shower here. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Totally my noise canceling headphones have started to make my ears sweaty, <laughs> but I refuse to take them off. <laughs> yes. So I'm guessing, yeah. Will, do you reckon that will breed a, a, a level of like uh, animosity? Hostility? Yeah. Yeah. Hostility. No, I think it'll be, be the opposite where we'll this? start to see him like a medieval king. Yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. Where we'll go in the reverse and we'll be like, well, he does deserve it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So what would that, I reckon, because one of you, one last base. Jack and I like, develop surf brain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So JD <laughs> and Jack. Uh, <laughs> movies. Surf we brain. We pay him a little tax on yeah. every food we get. We'll every ask him we... when we come back to Melbourne if he can just build us a little hut in his backyard. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. We'll farm yeah, for yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> If you need something. And you own every, the land and we yeah. don't. That's yeah. fine. Every we time you sit down for a meal, you're like, oh, sorry, and 10% for you, yeah, James. Yeah, of course, of course. King's tax for you, James. <laughs> Please don't do this. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, my lord. <laughs> my lord, we developed Please do not brain. behead me. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then, then yes. Uh, and then, then finally, actually, the, very, yeah. the last square, which is a free square, yeah. uh, which I've written down here, is that the uh, base of speculation takes some time off while you boys are in the UK. Yeah. Yes. Because uh, I'm I'm not doing, as, as previously uh, stated at the start, <laughs> Not doing this alone, uh, and I want to rest. God, uh, basic speculation alone is like the saddest show. Just being, that like, would just become one of those YouTube shows. What you do? You I broke just something. Broke something. Oh wow. Well, that's 
It's fine. It's, it's fine. The... fine. It's fine. What is it's that? It's just a little thing it for the... It hooks onto this. It hooks oh, onto okay. the thing, That's so fine. it's all neat. You don't have to worry about it. I'm not going to f- repair it. Uh, but, you yeah, know, doing this alone would be very... Just be being me. like, I don't know, man. I guess Agatha all along is probably not going to be very good. That yeah. comes out soon. Yeah. In fact, next week, maybe the week after, Holy we're gone mackerel. for it. Oh, yeah, damn, times. dude. That's we nice. can watch it on the plane home. What? Catch up on what Agatha's been up to. Maybe. Yeah. Was she a kill, witch all along? Kill some time, yeah, I guess. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, yeah. so we're, we're taking the time off. Yeah. Uh, and we'll be back, I guess, in, in October. October sometime mm-hmm. uh, when you boys are back in. And uh, I was going to say, and recover from jet lag. But I do know that, well, I know me and you, Jack, are yeah. doing, uh, well, we're doing packs for yeah. Diggers for Nerds, mm-hmm. our other show we're doing. And then you two boys are doing uh, On the Floor. Oh, yeah. As, uh, thumb cramps thumb as cramps. a tradition, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we'll also just be there the and whole time. Yeah, yeah. So, so it's, thumb um, cramps. we got media passes. Um, There's a whole bunch yeah. of game stuff happening that this week. There's yeah. Freak, that, that week, not this week. Yeah. Freak mm-hmm. on, Parallels. Yeah, we'll be yeah. at all of those. Heaps yeah. of shit going down. I uh, don't know if I've told you this yet, boys, uh, but I have. We are part of another festival in October. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> awesome, dude. Sorry, I, I think. Uh, uh, yeah, 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 oh, yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. I'll give I'll you some details in just a little quick second, but I believe it's like one of the Fridays. Mm-hmm. Uh, you'll be back for not that long. One of the Fridays, so probably the following Friday, I would you'd guess, because the other one clashes with packs. You'd yeah. really, really <laughs> hope. So like the third or fourth or something? I think it might be the fourth. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So we're back for six days. Yeah. Six days is heaps yeah. of time. Yeah, and we've, done, we've warmed up. We've done some podcasts. Yeah. I'm guessing this is plumbing the Death Star. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. So it's uh, yeah, it's for uh, the the. Uh, oh, can I announce half of this? I don't know actually. <laughs> yeah. but, we're doing uh, a thing. We're doing a thing in Melbourne. In Melbourne, yeah. Uh, Friday the fourth at uh, yeah eight forty five p.m. Where. I'll let you know. <laughs> As part of what? Don't worry about I'll it. I'll let yet. you know. You don't, you don't know uh, about Can it. people come to this? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, right. uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, yeah, so it's a, it's live. It's a, it's a it live, is a live thing. thing. And it is also live streamed. Mm. So it's a twofer. Okay. Well, we can't tell you what yet, but I, I believe. I don't know. I, maybe I can, but just in case I can't, because <laughs> I haven't read the contract <laughs> I signed. But I did sign it. Hey, that's the most important part. And it's one of those things where. Uh, yeah, the light. Hey, if when tickets do go on sale for this thing, there's not that many seats in the live audience, yeah. but yeah. it will be live streamed. Yeah. yeah, so you can watch it even if you're not from Melbourne. I think. Yeah, <laughs> I think. I'm pretty sure. Anyway, sure. keep an ear, keep an ear to the ground on a weathered eye to the horizon. We're doing stuff. Yeah, so just know that me and Jackson land back in Australia, and then we're like, time to acclimatize. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, oh, yeah. No. Don't oh, worry, shit. it'll oh, be no. good because you'll be, you know, it's a, it's a, it's an appropriate time for someone who's jet lagged at eight forty five on the. <laughs> The fourth, the fourth. 8.45 a.m. or a.m. A.m. would be good. Yeah, yeah. 8.45 p.m. on the fourth. You want to see the sleep- Friday the fourth. Sleepiest, <laughs> sleepiest boys in the world. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, no. I'm, no, that's good. That's awesome. I'm excited, frankly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, well, uh, 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 so we've got, the, we've got the bingo card here. Okay. Yep. Uh, so we've got uh, Jack. Shits himself. Mm-hmm. Boys get in a barrel. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Uh, a Cadbury tour happens. Yep. Okay. Uh, you have some wonderful haggis times. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Beast uh, takes break. some uh, time mm-hmm. off, which Free is already up. happening. Yeah. Uh, uh, Oasis is played in the van <laughs> to Manchester, <laughs> yep. causing uh, JD to get Oasis brain, mm-hmm. uh, which will end up Oasis with him up, getting yeah. some um, merchandise. Yeah. Oasis merch. Mm-hmm. Watch me buy a record and then claim that that doesn't count as merch. <laughs> <laughs> Hundred percent, hundred percent. That's absolutely happening. I'm looking forward to like maybe. Dude, the they've insta- got the master yeah. plan. This is like a B-side compilation album. That's like it's hard to get in Australia. That's it's merch. Like, I'm no, not no, 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 dude, it's not merch. It's a fucking record. It's a record, dude. I look That's forward to the to yes to the Instagram post of you holding up a record, <laughs> being like, it's not merch. <laughs> this is not merch. It's not merch. doesn't buy merch. Merch is such a merchandise. That's merchandise. <laughs> no, no a you play it, dude. Merchandise. It's not a fucking is hat, a CD, dude. Is a CD merchandise? Yes! Mm. <laughs> it's uh, a fucking MP3 merchandise? In a way. You know, it's digital mm, merch. A, it's digital merch? Digi merch. It is, mm. Yeah, I guess it is digital merch. Yeah. yeah. If you bought, like, say, a wallpaper for your phone, mm-hmm. that's a digital thing. That's digital that's, merch. That's digital merch. <laughs> Record doesn't count. <laughs> Uh, you finger Big Ben. Okay, yep. yeah, yeah. Um, you guys develop some surf brain for yep. James. Yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then JD hears the call of the void <laughs> yeah. Arthur's I think this sick. could be one of the uh, the Easiest. first ever BS B- Boys Bingo cards where it's just all ticks. Yeah, I, I think so. I think the one thing that I'm thinking that might not happen is the Cadbury tour. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Even, yeah. yeah. Well, Maybe. I but if we go right. to, like, like – I need to show Jackson this photo of the Fredo Frog guy in a costume because yeah. I think that's almost funny enough just to get a photo with him. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. For sure. Then that might. Then that's a. That's a tick. Yeah. yeah, that's, yeah, like, yeah. that's that's nine. That's nine boxes all ticked. Yeah. And Beautiful. I guess but before we leave, yeah, we're doing for a new a thing. Yes. Of, uh, weeks or a month. I don't know what day it is. <laughs> uh, so last week with JD having COVID. How yeah. you feeling, by the way? Doing alright? Uh, yeah, I'm fine. My yeah. appetite's not back, and my yeah. smell and taste also aren't fully back. But that's hey, good. what hey, are you gonna do? A little, little bit back. Yeah, they okay. they never went to zero percent active. Yeah, oh, yeah. I would say they dropped to about twenty percent, and they're probably at about sixty percent now. Okay, okay. So okay. things like if I'm eating a bland food, like a, a hot chip, yeah, mm-hmm. nothing. I can sort of I get the sensation that it's salty. Yeah, but if okay. I eat like chili, I'm like I can taste this. Okay, yeah, well, yeah you're getting back there. That's good. So yeah, we have a, an email address, one that we uh, have access to. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's a BS Boys Pod at gmail.com dot mm. uh, where you can email some questions. Please and, send and, us and emails, and we will them answer them for you. We're with... doing this for real, for real, yeah. from now on. Yeah. Already got a couple, and uh, one person here, a oh, wonderful Thomas. He asks, "Well, get well, uh, Dusha." I did. Yeah. All nice. jokes uh, aside, mate, I think was you're... that a joke? No, no, I'm, I'm, hey, I'm, I'm, Thomas, fuck, fuck you! <laughs> Sorry, Thomas, uh, we're off to a real good start. Uh, Get well soon, all jokes aside. Mate, what the fuck? Well, the subject, I was sick! The subject line was... Yeah, I didn't realize I had to explain all this. <laughs> I figured I'd just... I, I, honestly, I didn't realize I'd get to... <laughs> seven words... Um, and we'd have an argument. I apologize. That's on me. Thomas, who do you think you for, are? For not assuming <laughs> He's an unwell this. man. I was unwell, and then you said, get well, and I did, and then you said, I'm joking. Well, so the subject line was, uh, uh, get well, douche. Uh-huh. Now, it starts off, the email starts off, all jokes aside, mates, I think you're some funny fucks and enjoy all your content. Seriously, hope you feel better soon, JD. <laughs> was the sentence that he opens an email with. So he was very sincere. Yeah. you got to yeah. understand the old jokes aside. Did throw me, Thomas. Thank you. I am getting better. <laughs> he then goes on to ask, uh, do, do you all still enjoy comic book uh, properties or has the many podcasts you do basically numbed you to any sort of enjoyment beyond going to the zoo? Last month, I got comic book mania and spent like $300 on comic books. It mm. still happens. Yeah, yeah We absolutely. like comic books. We just wish the movies were good. Yeah. yeah again, I, I, I uh, although... Not the comic book movies have done this, but I think just like comic books in general, as mm. I've said many times, I'm very big and very excited for like you know the big sweeping changes that um, Hickman had done to yeah. to, to X Men, and then they they fucked it. So they they that has really well, that really put a dampener on yeah. my consumption of I guess the mainstream Marvel stuff. Yeah. Uh, but now we still read. I mean, I still read a bunch of yeah, uh, I, more independent got a or Hellboy like Hellboy Omnibus recently yeah. finished it. Last week or something. Yeah, I'm nice. thinking about watching the original version of The Crow currently. Yeah, That's yeah. a comic yeah, book movie. No, I haven't yeah. seen it. I don't I know s- why. Yeah, I haven't seen that. Oh, it's, it's pretty good. Yeah, I, I saw feel a, like that it was made for me when I was a teenager, and I just was like, oh, "Thank you, it. no, thank you." Yeah, I uh, saw yeah. A, a post recently where somebody was like, "I'm a 45 year old man, and I've been reading comics my whole life, and I just can't do it anymore." <laughs> yeah, I need a story <laughs> that finishes. Yeah, and, yeah, uh, it, yeah. You know, yeah. It just made me think of you all. A hundred percent. Like uh, going off uh, again. It's the you know, again, the Krakow Age yeah. was beautiful and it was like great. And then they fucked it like for two thirds or a quarter of the way in. You're like, ah, ah you were so good yeah. for so a small amount of time. Um, and then, yes, yeah, so and now I'm just kind of going back to like like Image or some other independent studios. Yeah. And I'm being like, hey, these ones are good. There, there's a start. And f- it's usually yeah. just like a one person who's creating it. You're like, oh, sweet, there's a dead. Yeah, oh, absolutely. It's, it's going to finish story. at some point. It's yeah. great. I don't have to be like, what's, what's this? Yeah. Ah, okay. They're getting across the, the point they're trying oh, to make yeah. and then we just all wash our hands and go yeah. our separate ways. It's lovely. Yeah. Even yeah. like when independent comics sometimes don't get finished, they kind of still have mm. a satisfying issue. Yeah, yeah, like absolutely. Southern Bastards. Yeah. Mm. That was meant to continue, but then one of the people that made it is a sack mm-hmm. of shit. Mm-hmm. Yep. But the end point that the comic leaves you with, you're like, this is still satisfying. Yeah, absolutely. For yeah, sure. Exactly. I think it's oh, the yeah. artist that sucks and not the writer, so oh. I don't feel too bad enjoying it still. Yeah, oh. fair. Yeah, Southern Bastards was, I remember yeah, reading that, well, was good for um, 
then I think I just dropped off. Yeah. And so that email was from um, um, a wonderful stoner in America named Wyatt. Thomas oh. is the next one. So, you, so Thomas, you got like a, a bonus <laughs> fuck you from JT for, uh, for a slight Thomas. letter. Cause you're getting your ne- sorry, my, 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 I apologize. My mistake. So uh, yeah, I guess so Thomas uh, took some of the heat that Wyatt <laughs> didn't even <laughs> really deserve. Taken, but uh, absolutely shouldn't have taken. Yeah. yeah. Right. Any, That's anyway. a risky take when you email the BS boys pod <laughs> at gmail.com. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> That's Not right. the, it's just no. BS Boys Pod yeah, at exactly. gmail.com. That's BS, the risk you take. Yeah. BS BOYS POD. BS Boys Pod. BS Boys Pod. It's fun to yeah. say. BS Boys Pod. BS Boys Pod. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so the next question is from Thomas. <laughs> uh, you want to get in business first? Thomas? You're on, you're, on, nice. you're on thin ice for fucking, some reason. Yes. Ooh. <laughs> Uh, do you think a Marvel and DC crossover yes. can ever happen on yes, film it will absolutely or happen. television? Fucking doubt- Batman will fucking pop up yeah. in fucking... It won't be Secret Wars, but it'll be the next thing. So I doubt an like, uh, amalgam universe would yeah. ever come about, but yeah, could there ever be a Spider-Man teaming up with Batman or Superman? That has happened in the comics. Do you think it'll go Hope DC- you all are staying warm. Thomas. Thanks, Thomas. Do you think it'll go DC to Marvel or yes. Marvel to DC? it'll be DC to Marvel. Warner mm. Brothers is trading water at best currently. Yeah. Mm-hmm. If Superman bombs, they yeah. are so fucked. It's true. That is true. It's yeah. really their last I- gasp. And then they'll be looking at how Sony just was shitting their pants yeah. Yeah. so violently, and then all of a sudden got a $2 billion movie because yeah. they teamed up with Disney. Yeah, true. Yeah, I reckon what will happen is, uh, yeah, uh, uh, they'll start just breaking off Warner Brothers, like, like peace style. They've like, already done it. Peace. Yeah, mm. yeah, but, like, even further. Yeah. Like, it won't be, like, DC. It'll be, like, Batman or yeah. the Bat family. Oh, they'll do the It'll 90s. be, like, the 90s yeah, Marvel, okay. like, when they were just breaking it Damn. off. Damn. And I reckon you're going to get something like that. Yeah. And uh, I reckon because of James Gunn's connection to, uh, like, uh, or, like, the Marvel Disney properties, stuff, yeah. there, there might be definitely, like, a, well, hey, we'll purchase this, this, and this, and then we do this, and then maybe we might see if they wanted to do like into the like uh, the MCU integration whatever they were going to chuck in like Hyperion mm. or the Sentry or whatever fucking like you know, JLA like you know SP yeah. kind of thing yeah, over yeah. there they'll be like oh no we actually have Justice just League there it is Superman. there it yeah, is yeah, yeah. Uh, I think that the first appearance we're going to get is that there'll be an actor in one of the James Gunn films mm. that is in so like basically you get an actor that was in the Marvel universe in the DC universe yeah and they'll be playing a character that's very similar and you won't get their names yeah. and people will be like that's the same I think that's guy. fucking would it Peter count Parker. would it count yeah if you they because uh they got Cavill for a little cameo in uh, oh, yeah. Deadpool Wolvie yeah would it count I, if I they, remember because like, I was hooting and hollering I remember yeah, too, oh, that one was yeah. for the real ones yeah. the yeah. nerds they finally rose up and won finally a finally, movie for a good, nerds finally yeah. dude it's finally safe to like a comic book movie yeah because Henry Cavill yeah. said so. Yeah. Yes. So do you reckon, uh, like, if they got, say, uh, Cavill and they would put him as, like, say, Hyperion or whatever, yeah. or, like, just a guy in maybe some, like, you know, farm kind of clothes, like a, like a, like a, like a flanny and maybe some, like, overalls or yeah. whatever, yeah. and they just didn't call him by anything? Like, they yeah. just called him, like, Hayseed or mm. Farm Boy or something like that, yeah. but he had those sort of, like... Yeah, you know, so, I mean, I think that what will happen is you will get... Yeah, one of the yeah one of the big DC guys in a Marvel movie at some mm. point yeah. through to convergence or whatever the fuck they call it, mm-hmm. um, but I think that they'll dip their toes first by yeah, doing something like okay. that, having yeah. an actor that's known, yeah, or even yeah, like yeah. fucking, I don't know. Let's just say like Batista, yeah. he'll be in a D- DC movie. Although I think it'll be the other way around, but just as an example, mm. yeah, they'll have him as a guy that's got like. He'll be wearing like a hood or something. Yeah. You see his face and he's got like, he still has like red skin, but he doesn't have the exact pattern uh, of drugs. Yeah, and yeah. then he won't have a name and he'll do like something small or be like strong. And yeah. Like, That's a drug. Is that? Yeah. What the fuck? Mm, I can see it being a kind of thing where they do like a, like not obviously as terrible. But I think that that will be them dipping their toes in and then the next thing yeah. they'll just go mm-hmm. full. I reckon I won't count that as a win. I won't mm, count yeah. like fucking, oh, that's Jimmy Olsen in mm. Secret Wars as a win. Mm. Okay. It'll only be if Batman's there. Yeah, okay. Like I a, could see a thing where one. they're like, it's like, you know, in maybe in Secret Wars and there's like a big CGI. All of the, because mm-hmm. presumably a scene like this will happen, all of the multiverses are converging. It's the biggest convergence that's ever fucking happened. And that one of those multiverses that comes in mm. will in some way be clearly stated to be the DC universe. I Like in a real, not like subtle way, but like as in... <laughs> you know, like I, I, I don't know. It's like blue and red and yellow or whatever yeah. is the color of it. And it's like, mm. 
Oh, or like Sentry if he's a character by this point because he's going to be in them. Um, oh, yeah. You know, he, there's like a scene where he gets split into all of the different Sentries, and one of them is very clearly Superman or something because yeah. they're like the same kind of character. Mm. I think it'll happen during the Convergence shit. Yeah. And that'll be they're testing the waters. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. then it's easier to swallow for a Marvel audience who are like, it works within the canon. Yeah. You know what I mean? Rather mm-hmm, than like mm-hmm, a. Mm-hmm. What are they the same universe? What the hell? Yeah. yeah. When did Batman become a guy in the Marvels? What the f- what the frick? frick? Dude, Secret Wars is only like two years away. That's awesome, huh? That's yeah, so dude. cool, dude. So exciting. Yes. I love well, maybe it's three years away and Doomsday's two years away. So How either way, are they we're very excited. filming these movies so quick? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We're, I don't know. We're but, uh, overjoyed. If anyone, well, I guess because uh, a guy just walks into a room and then <laughs> no, they're like, done. No, no, yeah. If anyone can do it, they can do it. They've built up so much goodwill. Exactly. How's yeah. Blade going? So good, I reckon. Great, man. Why would you even ask how good it's going? <laughs> it's, it's probably going incredible. Why even bring it up? Why Fantastic bring it up? Four comes out in like a year? Nine months. Yeah, and yeah dude. It just started filming. No, yeah, yeah, it's no. gonna go well. they, They've nailed it. They've, they did that test footage or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you got Galactus's big eye looking through a window. He's having a peep. He's having a peep. Huh? Huh? King Kong style. Huh? Yeah, yeah, that's good. Uh, it's just pretty good. And, uh, and, and, and I guess we'll uh, end up on this last question mm-hmm. here, which is uh, from the, uh, the, the the Dear Baseless uh, Discord channel, uh, yeah. the Sans Pants Plus Discord, which can only be um, accessed to if you are either a member of uh, the BS Boys Plus or uh, Bad Brain Boys Plus on uh, Sans Pants Radio. Uh, and uh, 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 Gobathon, what a great name. Great Gobathon. Name, Love to enter a Gobathon. <laughs> <laughs> As a judge or a contestant? Uh, either or. Yeah. I'm just happy to be involved. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, so Gobathon asks, what classic movie would you turn into an unnecessary 12-episode prestige TV series? Hmm. I mean, I might be thinking of this because it's in the t- in the question you just asked, but mm-hmm. I can absolutely imagine them being like, brother, 2026, mm-hmm. a 10 part miniseries, mm-hmm. Warner Brothers, mm-hmm. HBO Max, Max presents mm-hmm. the Prestige, the Prestige, the Prestige, <laughs> the Prestige, <laughs> Is it a porno? the Prestige, yeah. <laughs> the Prestige. Wow, that's did not, what I heard. Yeah, the, honestly, I did not think uh, where that was going to go. I thought you were going to because like a few people in the Discord were talking about like, t- like 12 Angry Men. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I thought, yeah, 12 in this, you were going to go there, but mm. no, the prestige. The prestige. Yeah. Oh, the prestige. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. How can they be twins? How the, can they be twins? The cans or something. <laughs> oh. Yeah, think about magic. Because yeah, nothing has been in more now than magic. Yeah, magic is huge. No. Oh, yeah, David Blaine, he's got that Disney thing yeah, or that's whatever. True, that's Everyone true. loves that guy. But also, don't fucking- look into him. Christopher Nolan's fucking just rolled out of Oppenheimer. Yeah, yeah that's, true. That's, that's true. That's true. That's true. I can say the prestige. That yeah. feels like the kind of thing that you like. It's like a movie everyone remembers and some people quite like. Mm-hmm. So I yeah. think it is fine, but very overrated. Yeah, that's fair. I haven't seen it in ages. It. I don't remember. Yeah. Um, what was the movie that came out at the same time as the prestige? The, oh, the, the magician, the illusionist, or the illusion. The, yeah, that's right. The, the illusionist. illusionist. With, I think uh, they'll make Norton. Right? Yeah. yeah. I think they'll make that into a 12-part prestige okay. TV series um, at the same time as your prestige TV series. Yeah, that'll be fun. Mm. Yeah. Uh, we got – what other stuff could they do? I'm going to put forward 101 Dalmatians. Yeah. So I think a prestige, uh, like, yeah, 10, 12-part, like, maxi series um, about trying to raise um, a lot of dogs while some maniac wants to make them into coats. Uh, could be good. That is an awesome premise yeah. for a movie. Yeah, yeah. Someone wants to make my dogs into clothing. Yeah. That's, and that and I wish they wouldn't do that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, dude. Yeah. Well, Cruella DeVille got the movie Cruella recently. If, yeah. You know. I think there's a sequel coming soon. Really? Well, mm. there you go. Cruella's a, a hot button issue. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm trying to think of other. You know what I mean? <laughs> there's probably some, like, it, it's just like any drama that's like, like something like Heat. They could turn Heat oh, into yeah. a Oh, yeah, because uh, they, they have a sequel. I think yeah, he wrote Heat a, too. Um, yeah, he wrote a yeah, book. Yeah, yeah. 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 Um and yeah, you could tell you could turn that into a It's a prequel and sequel as well, but there you go. So what you want to do there is you you go like the like the first the first five episodes yeah. is a prequel. Then there's like a little bit of a break where it's just like go watch the movie <laughs> Heat. <laughs> yeah. Then, heat happens here. And then and then and then, and then five episodes. Yeah. Yeah. The sequel. I'm surprised I haven't tried something gone like really fucking bold with it and like tried to make the Godfather into like mm. a mini series. What about yeah. the Truman show? 
I'm shocked the Truman Show hasn't had that. Kind or of... Ed TV. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm. Joe versus the volcano. Mm. Mm. Tammy and the T Rex. Okay, now we're cooking, fellas. Oh, now we're getting maybe. some yeah, juice yeah, going. Yeah, yeah. Oh, is, it, is, it, is it called SFW? The uh, the one with uh, Stephen Dorff and Terry Hatcher? What? Where they uh, basically become reality TV stars because they get basically uh, held hostage in a, a convenience store. Is um, SFW stand for safe for work? No, it stands for so fucking what? Whoa. It becomes what? a big sensation, yeah, because uh, yeah, the the character That's they're so in 90s. this like uh, yeah, it's yeah, so nineties, yeah, so dude. 90s. Uh, because yeah, yeah, yeah Stephen Dorff basically becomes like it's a bit rally TV. They, yeah. they they take hostage of like he's like one of the hostages. Yeah, yeah. whoever does it, they take hostage of this uh, convenience store, and they won't let anyone in, and then they just broadcast what's happening like basically twenty four hours. Huh? Yeah, and like uh, at the end of it, uh, well, towards the end, uh, Stephen Dorff's character's like, "You're gonna kill me? You're gonna do this? So oh, fucking what?" And then it becomes. It's basically like a, a rallying cry for Whoa, Gen X. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. like yeah. network. Yeah. I yeah. stick my head out the window and I say, I am not going to take it anymore. Yeah. You know, network? Why did you, you say that know. like in a JFK? Because that's kind of how it's set up. Oh, okay. Fair enough. I've not seen the movie, so yeah, I wouldn't Network fucking rocks. Dude. Yeah. Uh, another movie that they could definitely turn into a 10 part series and Kevin, pick up your phone because yeah. you're going to want to hear this. Clerks. Yeah, true. True, yeah. true, true. Clerks could they could do it with clerks. They could do yeah. like in a yeah, like a ten part like a universe kind of yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Easy. Easy. Yeah, they'd have to recast though, and I think Kevin Smith would hate that. Yeah. True. He'd still play Silent Bob. Nah, no, you'd have to recast. No, no, no. Dante's Are there. You... Well, you haven't Randall's seen Clerks. There. You haven't seen Clerks too. I have not. Yeah. They die? Um uh, spoilers, Dante dies. No, uh, right. Rip Dante, rip dude. Dante. Didn't, yeah. didn't um, Rosario Dawson's character also die? Yeah, she dies that? off screen in the movie. Yeah. Okay. How does Dante get got? Shot? He, heart attack? Heart attack. Yeah. That's so yeah. sad. So, How old's the kid? Can't remember. <laughs> That's sad. Randall got to raise it or something? So Randall has a heart attack first. Oh, they both get a double. <laughs> what, the yeah. what the hell? The and fuck? then he's like, "Fuck, I've wasted my life." So he then decides he's he makes clerks, and then Dante dies straight after that. He makes clerks and <laughs> clerks three. Yeah, they make clerks and clerks three. The fuck? Is it like do they yes. make clerks clerks, or is it a reimagining of clerks and they get different actors? So they basically, they, there's different actors, okay. but it is, they're making clerks. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. It's so meant it's to like be. We're making clerks and they just show footage from the 90s. Like <laughs> No, but it is a recreation yeah, 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 with yeah. the of black the, and yeah, white. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. And okay, like okay, they okay, have okay, the okay. thing of like, you're going to, like a discussion about the ending of the movie yeah. and the original show. It, like Clerks 3 is a love letter to Clerks, but also a love letter to Kevin Smith's heart attack. Uh, Whoa, that's awesome. So does he see himself as Randall? Or does he see himself as Dante? I think he sees himself as Dante. It's a very... Look, basically Clerks 3... He survived his heart attack. (laughs) (laughs) He he made Clerks 3. Why would he... And now he's making the 430 movie, which is a love letter to his time where he worked at the movies or went to the movies. (laughs) But the character that's his character, like his insert, is played by Harley Quinn Smith, which is his daughter's boyfriend. Yeah. Which is weird. Why is he making a love letter to when he went to the movies? <laughs> I, I think it must be when he worked at the movies. Did he yeah. work at the movies? Yeah, I'm pretty sure he did. Okay, okay. that makes more that sense than that time. I mean, I... people go to the movies and they love it. Yeah, I know, but that's true. I suppose. Yeah. yeah. Feels like making a love letter to go to the store. Yeah. Go well, that's what shop. clerks sort yeah. of is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think it's more of a love letter of working at the, the store. store. Yeah, people don't, yeah. Or facing adversity in a shit job yeah. and then dying. And you then... should watch Clerks 3. It's one of those movies that. I wouldn't recommend it in a way where it's good. Yeah, I think right. it's significantly better than Clerks 2, but it is 10,000 times weirder than that movie should be. Because okay. it's like, okay. it's not really that funny, but it is a bit funny. Yeah. But it has huge emotional beats. The opening of the film is set to Welcome to the Black Parade, but the whole song, which goes on nearly six minutes. <laughs> what the fuck? Weird movie. Because I know he did like yeah like a, almost a like a, a music video in Clerks Two. <laughs> yeah, well, he basically does the same thing in Clerks Three, but it's the opening. <laughs> That's crazy, dude. Damn. Well, well, Clerks, Clerks, gotta dude. Go watch Make it, it into a ten episode mini series yep. or whatever. Mm. I won't watch it, but Kevin Smith, I hope you're doing well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Sounds like you're going through some stuff. Absolutely. Mm. Yeah, well, you shouldn't bad. be friends with your uh, daughter's boyfriend when he's like twenty two and you're fifty. 
I think you could be friends with your, your daughter's boyfriend. Your daughter's boyfriend. No, but like they're like it's got like, like a yeah. best friendy kind of thing, not just like oh I'm friendly. Well, to why you. can't you why be friends with your friendly? stepdaughter's bo- your daughter's boyfriend? Yeah, doesn't that seem fucked up to you? No, not really. Especially like again, is, I mean, presumably the the they've only been together for like the, is he in the industry like kind of thing? No, Kevin Smith brought him into the industry. I mean, he's part of Kevin now Smith's life. Him. Yeah, yeah but he's then, around. Yeah. You're gonna get know. to know him. You know, maybe it's gonna be like, oh yeah, they're you know, yeah, maybe they've been dating for how many years? Not that long. Okay, I think I'd, I'd I would want to be either really good friends with my daughter's uh, husband or boyfriend. En- boyfriend, either way, I don't care. Or enemies. I think either way is good. I think that I want nothing to do with, like, as in, like, I'll be friendly to them, but in the same way that I, my family, treats like a partner or something like that, or just like kind, but I don't want them like, you don't want it like hanging out. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Too much like that? But also the age gap. The age gap is You can the be thing. friends with a 50-year-old. Yeah, you can be friends. I mean, now I can. Yeah. But I was like 17. Would you want me to be friends with a 50-year-old? If he's like, your I mean, if girlfriend's your... dad. Yeah. I was friends with my girlfriend's dad when I was... Friends? Yeah. Or just friendly? Uh, I guess we'd, we'd hang out or whatever, but not like, again, it would be incidental. We weren't like, you know, going to the cafe together. Yeah, but that's what he's doing. It's nice, I guess. Okay, well, maybe it's nice. Maybe, <laughs> well, you, maybe, nice. You maybe, maybe I'm maybe, wrong. Hey, I don't know this guy. Maybe he's like, yeah, I haven't really ever had like maybe a, a, a male father figure. Oh, uh, he's my a life big Kevin Smith fan, I think. That's, that, that, that's nice. It's, it's good stuff, I guess. Yeah, mm. Nice little, you know. I know. I gotta read more about this because I remember reading it, being like, "What the fuck?" But now that you've put me under all these yeah, questions, this, is, this just sounds nice. <laughs> sounds it's like a pleasant relationship like, yeah. with the. Uh, sounds healthy to be honest. Yeah, yeah. well, just in-law. from what Father we know, in-law. if yeah, it yeah, yeah. isn't and it's weird, <laughs> well, take anyway, we'll, we'll let you know when we return sometime in October yeah, what yeah, we've yeah, learned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Till then. On that note, <laughs> I like till then. <laughs> till then, I've been Joe. Till then, citizens, I've been Jackson. <laughs> and I've also been Joe. Goodbye. <laughs> See ya. And we've been the BS Boys. And this has been another episode of Baseless Speculation. Yeah. Backwards, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Look out. And, and we are going to the zoo. Just it's, it's, going, it's busy it's, time. Uh, come on. Get off a fucking case. I don't know if I can do it overnight. Christ Maybe a day almighty. trip. Maybe a day trip. I'm covered in fluff. Why are you covered in fluff? I don't know. <laughs> that human hair or cat hair? Very short.